Asanoe II Philadelphos. Asanoe II Philadelphos lived from circa 318 or 311 to circa 270 or 268 BC, and was the daughter of Pharaoh Ptolemy I and Queen Berenike I. In circa 300 or 290 BC, she married King Lysimachus of Thrace and bore him three sons. During the War of the Diadochi, Queen Arsinoe II manipulated King Lysimachus to execute his elder son Agathocles, whom was his son with a Persian noblewoman named Nicaea. Because she feared Agathocles would kill her sons if he took the throne, in circa 285 BC, Agathocles was put on trial, found guilty of plotting against his father, and executed. After the death of King Lysimachus, after the Battle of Choropedium, in 281 BC, Queen Arsinoe II established her own city in Ionia, named after herself. When a Seleucid army entered the city, she was able to escape by dressing up one of her attendants in her royal robes. The Seleucid army killed the attendant, and the queen escaped while dressed as a commoner. The queen's half-brother, Ptolemy Serenuus, killed King Seleucus I Nicator and proclaimed himself king of Thrace and Macedon. To legitimize his rule and to avoid conflict, Ptolemy Serenuus married Arsinoe II. After Ptolemy Serenuus murdered her two youngest sons, her eldest son, Ptolemy, escaped to Illyria, and Arsinoe II took up sanctuary on the island of Samothrace. In 277 or 275 BC, Arsinoe II returned to Egypt. She then married her full brother, Pharaoh Ptolemy II, in circa 275 or 274 BC. During the wedding, they were compared to Zeus and Hera, and to Osiris and Isis. She ruled Egypt alongside her husband as pharaoh, unlike many Ptolemaic queens. She assisted Ptolemy II during the First Assyrian War, which lasted from 274 to 271 BC, and played a major role in foreign policies between the Ptolemaic and Seleucid kingdoms. In 272 BC, Osinoe II won three chariot races during the Olympic Games. She became a role model for future Ptolemaic queens, such as Queen Cleopatra VII.